We insert a page by using the insert option at the top left of our editing screen. When we click on it, a series of options for different pages appear. When we highlight the text option, a drop down side menu appears and we want the title page which is at the bottom of that list. So we highlight the title page and a preview of the page appears. You'll see it says a simple page for displaying a title. So we'll select this one by clicking on it. When we do this, the page appears on the left. And you'll notice that it has three properties for that page on the right and that they're different to the properties for the object. So the object has five different properties. This particular page has three different properties. And the number of properties vary according to which page you're selecting. But for our title page there are only three. The three main properties are the page title, the title text and the text size. There are also some optional properties which we'll come back to later. So we're going to start by altering some of our page title properties. And the first thing we're going to change is the page title, which appears on the navigation bar at the top of this first page. So we're going to put in a title of introduction so we've added introduction as the page title and we're now going to add some text which will appear on the front page itself the title text is the way that you'll introduce your pack so I'm going to put in an introduction to dog reads. I'm going to leave the text size at 30 and I'm now going to publish and preview my work to see how it looks. Publishing your learning pack or your project is the same as saving it and it's a good idea to do this before you actually play or preview the pack. When you publish your pack nothing significant will appear to have happened but the button becomes highlighted in green. So having published our pack we're now going to play it and look at a preview. 